So in this video, we've got an algebraic function, the probability of x being equal to r is k times 6 minus r times 1 plus r. And we're told that r goes from 0 to 4, 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And we need to find the value of k. How we're going to do this is we're going to draw a, the tabular form of this discrete probability distribution. So let's have our values of r in the top row. So we've got 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And in the bottom, we're going to have the probability of x being equal to r. So when r is 0, we have k times 6 times 1. So we just have 6k. When r is 1, we have k times 5 times 2. So we'd have 10k. When r is 2, we're going to have k times 4 times 3, so 12k. When r is 3, we've got k times 3 times 4, so 12k again. And finally, when, k is, when r is 4, sorry, we've got k times 2 times 5, so 10k. So that is the actual uh, the tabular form. We now use the fact that the sum of the probabilities, well, in this case, r, is equal to 1. So 6k plus 10k plus 12k plus 12k plus 10k must be equal to 1. So 6, 10, so 16, 28, 30, 40... 50k must be equal to 1, and then divide both sides by 50, and so k must be 1 over 50. Okay, So that has found us of our value of k. The tabular method makes it easy to see uh, what the individual probabilities are, and then we just use this format in order, well, th this um, result, sorry, to actually solve an equation for K.